Once again, we're going to be looking at the very first trailer for Superman and Lois. Uh, I'm hoping this is going to be a good season. Last season, for me, was kind of up and down. But overall, it was a very satisfying season. Now, let's check this out. See what's going to possibly happen this season. And I'll give you guys my thoughts. Because I gave it to the world a long time ago. Let me go with you. Just to watch your back. Clark? Back! You left our son home alone to have. No, this is a national security situation. No, it is a family situation. Superman and Lois, new episodes January 11th. Alright. Okay. <clears throat> huh. Okay, I thought I was going to show more. Okay, from first instances, there's going to be issues, obviously, with the alternate version of Lois' daughter, where it's really not her daughter, but it is, so that's going to be a problem. And for some reason or other, Lois is wanting to blame Clark, aka Superman, for something, don't know what. The government, I guess, is now trying to have him just be loyal to America, not, I guess, help out any other country, when he is sworn to protect the world, not just one specific country. And that's going to show, I mean, there's always been a problem where he always tries to put his family and his job as Superman, you know, try to balance it out, and it's incredibly hard. So that's going to be a very big problem, and it's going to be showing this season, I'm guessing, as well as also other issues with the military that may be shown, as well as also allegiances, and at the same time with his sons as well. So it's going to be kind of interesting to see what exactly they're going to be doing this season when it kind of seems like again Lois is putting a lot on Clark even though she knows who he is and what he does but at the same time you got to realize you know hey your 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 husband is Superman he can't just stay home all the time he's got to be out there and that's who he is and I think that's what they're going to try to show in this season even though again she knows you married him you know this is what he's doing but I don't know I, I just I feel like there's going to be a lot of drama because of an alternate daughter where it's really going to show a lot of issues and I, I don't know I don't know if I fully agree with that I, I don't know I mean I just it just seemed like that ever since she arrived she's going to have an attitude and a problem obviously with her dad now being out of Superman oh well why would you work with him when he killed mom and it's going to be like well no he's not the same person I thought he was but he's not you know he's a father and everything. It, it, it's just, it, you're going to have moments like that. So I'm hoping that this season is going to be very good. I'm praying that it will be. I'm hoping that it sticks to the story and not to any kind of other agenda, which what we've seen CW shows do. And you guys know that to any kind of SJW woke agenda, which I'm praying they don't do that because then it's going to ruin Superman and Lois for me because Supergirl did that. And that's the reason why I really stopped watching Supergirl. But let me know what you guys think about this down in the comments down below. Are you guys ready for season two? What do you guys think about season two? Just so far from the trailer, let me know down in the comments down in the comments down below. If you guys are new to the channel, it's about subscribing. Leave a big fat like on the video if you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you guys on the next one.